In a tragic turn of events, three individuals, Medio Kashiri, Petros Mwale, and Anthony Murombondawana, met their untimely demise at Butter Farm in Bindura. The unfortunate trio had sought the services of two traditional healers, Isaac Beningo and Wilbert Firemu, in hopes of performing a money-making ritual. However, their quest for wealth led them to their deaths. Mwale had known the Sangoma since 2020, but Kashiri and Dawana first encountered Miningu and Veremu at a house in Unity LCK in Shitungwiza. The trio allegedly engaged the Sangomas for assistance in making a lot of money and were advised that the rituals would have to be conducted at Miningu's homestead in Madziwa. They made a decision to leave poverty behind and Kashiri drove them in a Honda CRV to Madziwa on the 23rd of April 2021. They slept at the compound preparing for their ritual the following morning and at around 8 a.m. the Sangomas invited them into the spare bedroom where they sold them a sandawana before commencing the first session of the money-making ritual. It is alleged that several rituals were conducted and the last session payment for the services were to be done under a muhacha tree away from the homestead. At around 8 p.m. Miningo invited the trio into his Toyota Corolla while Veremu took charge of Kashiri's Honda CRV and took off to finish off the ritual. They drove to Butter Farm where the Sangomas allegedly laced or packed beer with poison and a concoction containing Zepete. The pair gave the concoction to the trio, telling them it was part of the ritual. And once incapacitated, they strangled them to death and left their bodies beside the dam. They took off with the Sandawana and the money that they had been given for the rituals. The bodies were discovered on the 25th of April 2021, showing signs of a violent end, with their bodies bleeding and their mouths filled with froth. Miningu was apprehended shortly after, and in a desperate attempt to escape justice, he jumped from a moving vehicle, resulting in injuries that required him to be stretched into the court. His accomplice was still on the run. He faces charges of murder and escaping from lawful custody. This harrowing incident serves as a grim reminder of the dangers of engaging in such risky endeavors and the lengths to which some people will go for financial gain.